Hey there, Steve here. Hope you're doing well. If you're new to the channel, then welcome. Today we're going to be looking at a wonderful chord trick that the band Delta Sleep pretty much use in all of their songs. And it creates some wonderful tension and release. And the reason why is because these two chords, the E and the C sharp minor, are within the same key. And then when we go to this C major chord, it's not within the key, so our ears don't expect to hear it. So this C major chord is borrowed from the parallel minor, which is E minor, and I've written it as a flat major sixth, because if you look in the key of E major, we originally have this C sharp minor. However, in the key of E minor here, we have a C major, just a natural major. So we can say we've gone from C sharp just to C natural. So how is this any use to you? Um, I Well, first thing is you should have a little go at the chord progression I just shown you, and then you could try it in a different key. So let's say you take A major and A minor, your first is going to be the A major chord. Then your sixth degree in that one is going to be F sharp minor. Now you know that if you have A minor, you can remember flatten that F sharp and then you're going to have F major instead. Whenever you've got a minor six, there's always that major sixth just one semitone down. So you can use this trick absolutely anywhere. You can do the same with the minor third as well. There's always a major third, um, one, one fret lower. So if you're in the key of A, let's say, A major seven, C sharp is going to C sharp minor. It's going to be the third. And now we know that there's a, a major third a step lower. That's the Delta Sleep trick. It's up to you to go and experiment with them, find out what you like, what you want to put into your progression. If you find yourself trapped within a, uh, a diatonic key, so everything's sounding too samey, that's one way you can break out of that one. Thank you very much for watching this video. Thanks very much to the patrons that are supporting the channel. If you want to support the channel, there's links for that down below. Um, I do have a Mathrock Discord where we uh, chat quite often on there. And we also have a monthly hangout at the end of the month on there as well. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Okay, goodbye.